scavenger hunt. So we're getting y'all prepared for tomorrow. Okay, first rule. Work as a team. Love your partner. Be one with your partner, okay? It'll help you get an A. Everybody likes A. Okay. Um, at each station, y'all pay attention. There is an index card attached to like a cone or a wall. You gotta look for it, okay? Please put any equipment that you use exactly, like back exactly where you got it for the next group, okay? So if you pull the index card out of the cone when you're done, put it back in. Everybody got that? Yes? Okay, cool. Um, you get an absence for the day if you want, leave the gym. So if you need to go to the restroom or something, ask one of us, okay? Number two, cheat. Don't cheat, okay? You need this, you need all of these steps for tomorrow. So it benefits you to do this all the way. And four, uh, all exercises must be completed to the best of your ability. At each cone or area, there's an activity that you have to do. Some of them's push-ups, sit-ups, burpees. Do them, okay? If we see you not doing them, we're gonna ask you and your partner to sit out and you don't get any points for the day. Okay? It's if considered you, cheating if you don't do the activity. Yeah, so if you have an injury or something, let us know prior and we can adjust, like Greg already did, he's hurt his leg, okay? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so just, just, just sit up the top. So everybody got the rules? Any questions? You had a question? No, I was going to ask about the because he's broken. Yeah, you right. told me already. All right, no more questions about rules. Everybody understands that? Everybody understands the rules? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. All right, this is the card you will receive. It has your group number on it. For each station, you need to find the degree. How many feet to that next point? Then the color of the card at that point, and also the activity on that card. My you card, she means index card. They're yeah. all different colors. They're all different colors. So for example, the first one right here is gonna go from point one to point three. Before you leave that point, you need to look and see what the degree is. All right, everybody remember how to get the degree? We're gonna review over that in just a few minutes. All right, and you'll do that for each point. There's five that you're gonna have to write, all right? Oh, and by the way, the point that you start at, you don't have to do the activity yet, okay? So where you start, you don't have to do it. You do it at the next one. All right, and everybody's points are different. Just because there's two groups at one doesn't mean they're going to the next same point. So don't try and cheat and copy off theirs, because we'll catch you, and you'll be out for the day. <laughs> you'll also be wrong, oh, man. and no one likes And that's how we'll know, because it'll be wrong. Oh, my. Alright? Oh, little review. On this card, you have to write the distance in feet. You know your paces, in case you forgot. This is how you get your pace. Right here is how you get the distance. You multiply your paces by the feet per pace. We'll give you the distance in feet. Alright? So if you don't already have that written on your card, it may benefit you to do that. Because if you're all the way over there at five, you can't read that. Or if you're all the way over there in three, you're not going to be able to see okay, that. Right here. What is Paces <coughs> times feet per pace equals distance. All right. Anybody have any questions about that? All right. Does anybody have any questions about their compass? How to work it? All right. I need one person from each group to come up here. Do you have the same groups? No, we already told people. Yeah, okay. We already got it down. And please have a seat after you grab your focus.
already know your fee for a pace. It is on your card. No, I got to do my Yes. All right, group one. When I call your name, come get your card and go stand at your first point. Do not start or move until we tell you. It's on your card. Group one, Matt W. and Greg. Group two, Sam and Laura. Group three, Maddie and Will. Y'all quit talking so everybody can hear, please. Group four, Hunter and Sydney. Group five, Lindsay and E. Group six, Matt L and Cello. Group seven, Carl and Jordy. Group eight, Spencer and Alonzo. Group nine, Deidre and Mike. Deidre, Mike. Oh, 10, Dylan and Leo, and 11, Chanel and Christina. She had the finish line, Mike. <laughs> Close your compasses! Do not open your compass yet. Your first point is where it says start. There's a point after that. What fell? We need some glasses. Really good. I said she needs a glasses. Okay, so we're starting here and we have to find a degree and a fee and then the card do that. Can so I see your card here on my camera? So can you explain the card to me? Okay, so right here is the groups that we're going to start in. So we're here at two and we're going to use our compass to find the degree to the next location. And then we're going to calculate the fee to that degree, and then we're going to do the activity that's on the card. Very good. This is for next semester's person that's teaching. It'll help them. Give them ideas. They're on the move. Let's not forget to do the activity when you get to your second point. Maddie's by herself today, huh? William helped a lot last time, so I don't know. But that's good. It's yeah, it's preparing her for tomorrow. So right. She's stronger. That's true. Jess is over there helping her. That's a good thing. Here comes Leo and Dylan.
Okay, explain to the camera what they're doing for the, for the next teacher up next year that, that, that might do this activity. Okay, well basically, behind Maddie, um, basically what they're doing is we put them at a starting point and they have to find uh, how many feet it takes to get to the next point. So they're going to pace it out and then they do the math and then once they get to a station, um, I have like an exercise activity for them to do. So like over here, Leo and them, they have to do, I believe it's 15 sit-ups. Uh, over here where Sam and Laura are, it's push-ups. Uh, on this back wall, we've got jump ropes, jumping jacks. Let's see. Burpees are in that back corner over there. Okay. We got wall sits. I put them. Uh, I made sure I put a stopwatch over there so they can. Uh, they have to do it for 30 seconds. Uh, number four, they have to lunge forward to the cone and back. Good. Uh, look, there you go over there. Yes. Carl's see. doing his burpees. And I'm trying to think of what that one is over there. Oh well, I get sure, the general yeah. idea. So How long did it activities. take to plan this activity? How much prep time you got in it? Probably like a couple days, to be honest. We kind of, we had to think out what we wanted to do for this day specifically. So we came up with the obstacle course. That way they were better prepared for tomorrow. Now that you've planned it, do you think you could execute it like in multiple classes sure. again and again? Mm -hmm. And like use it for, mm -hmm. yeah, good. But the first planning is awful, huh? Oh, yeah. It takes a lot of energy. To... From, from when we did our first uh, lesson plan to now, it's definitely change drastically so can you imagine trying to throw something together in a day no it would yes. be impossible oh miss connie we're in there oh the number. the number sorry i just put the call with the activity to the side so it wouldn't be in the way that's cheating push-ups you're all supposed to be able to pass fitness gram you know you know your high school kids are going to do the same thing huh cheat push-ups you know, look, he can still do push-ups. He hasn't gotten that out of shape. And Sydney can do push-ups as well. Look at that. I'm impressed with my PE majors here. Look, guys, the mats, y'all can't use those. I put those there for you. Yeah, a few years ago. They hurt my elbows. Sam is trying to get her line of sight here. Put the wave in and then put it down. You see it? So, 260. Wave. That'd be 290. I only get 260. Stay in the way. Hey, psst. Okay. Ready? Leo! Stay in the way. <laughs> He's not budging. I'll just put it where he is. To help the next teacher. Here, look. What the heck? Okay. Go with it. Oh, count? Look at those sit-ups. Look at those sit-ups. <laughs> Michael, don't look so depressed. It's a good day. There's only 11 days of school left. Y'all be, be happy. 11 days of school. Bend those knees. Mike, you got to sit on my feet. Hold her, hold her feet. Oh, hold her feet. Well, yeah, it's just she, she has, she's not 18 anymore. You know? It does make it a lot easier, doesn't it? Oh, I saw them give you your running shoes back to you. Yeah. yeah. I'm proud. I've been putting in three miles a day. So finally got where I can walk again. My, my, uh, almost. Fighting way. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Get him, go. Go, go. Look, that's how you do it. You gotta look through. You see what this thing is right here? Line it up with this line right here. 
You gotta kind of hold it flat and see what degree is gonna come out if you're angling that number four. Oh, don't hold it flat, please. Okay? Yeah. Wait, let me take it off. Put it around your neck so if you drop it, you don't break it. Gotcha. Yeah, and this is the video you'll be doing. You'll be teaching this on your video. Line it up. Okay, you're Mixed not looking list. through the magnet. You're looking through that little line. This right here. Now put it down a little bit because you're going to have to this, this try way. to see. You see that little yeah. little yeah. Little yeah. Makes sense? This is just lining. That site right here is just lining it up with that line. So, what so you're going to actually look through this little line right All here. Right. But this is just to help you line that up. You, you see where it is? And I'm going to the full. Yes. All right. Now, now where? You keep your hand like that. You're going to tilt it a little. Now go straight down. Straight down. Huh? No, you stand up because you're going to have to see what degree it is. Jeez. No. Look at the red numbers. And see what number. See what number is that. 270. Okay. That's all right. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Is it numbers to numbers or numbers to phone? Okay. Now we're going to look. We're going to Yes, I've gotten in the way a couple times myself. I need to come over here so I can pick up your voice. Uh, well, it's no. Not Cameras don't pick it up like your ears. You can take it off to do that. Don't you wish you didn't wear blue jeans today? Yep. Yep. Sam is dressed appropriately. Sam, her hair, what? What's that next number? One or two. Where's two? Oh, there. Down the corner of the number. Good morning, Doug. Then you want to interrupt my All right. I got 35. 180. Let's see, he's writing oh. his stuff down on his card. Mm -hmm. Watch her do her burpees. She's going to demonstrate correctly. Hunter can, wore his jeans today, but and his deck shoes, but he he can still do it. He didn't mind getting them all sweaty and nasty because he's a student today and not a, a teacher. But he did lose his dress out points front in PE today. If it was high school, oh. he came in and didn't have. Well, I asked him if it was okay if I wore jeans. So the teacher gave you permission. Yeah, that's nice real kid. It's a boring theory and don't worry about going change. You gave your, your kids special permission to wear blue jeans today because they didn't have to do a lot? Correct. Okay. <laughs> Just verifying with your teacher. We talked about. And she's checking to see if they got all their stuff right. She's got her, her notes here. The degrees are off generally by 10. So make sure you're doing an average, take three, do your average, and your paces are off. So both of you pace it out and figure out how many feet and then average your feet and see if you get a little bit closer. Because okay. you're off by at least 10 to 15 feet, almost of them. And our degrees if, aren't right either? Correct. If there's an X, it's wrong. If there's a check, you're right. I see a lot of X's. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, you're not the only ones. It's hard, so just make sure when you do your compass and you have it, that you're centering 
your wire and then you're looking through this notch okay. here and it'll, when you look through that notch too it'll make that black line thicker and go number to number yeah. okay. yeah, we'll slow <laughs> That's okay. We're learning. But it's a, it's practicing to today. We're not again. in a championship right now. You do not have to do the activities again. Right. Yeah, from all that running and then. <laughs> Eight. Bathing suit weather's coming. Got to get in shape. I know. Are you going to tell us when we got wrong? Yes. Right. Got uh, we're giving a five degree difference, which is saving yeah. you on a couple of them. Yeah. <laughs> get tired of living on a thousand calories a day. And, and running 15, 20 miles away. Yes, ma'am. I got to move. <laughs> got to. Step aerobics. Paces are off. As are y'all both pacing it out and then calories. averaging it? Or both how doing fast nine. you run is how, both the do long, long, That's all we say. Long, work as a team. Uh, and if you both do both yeah. people, then you can see but if somebody fell. My knee, had, my knee it probably hurt like once this week. It didn't really hurt right here. But like, those oh. are... Yeah, go, go do your stuff. We'll talk about boxing later. All the paces. Can you bring this to someone? Yes. Sorry, I tried well, to beat I'm so place. glad you didn't run over me. <laughs> that would... back behind I tried you. to beat Dylan. I got excited. He's doing me a favor while I check. Yes, four is over there. Wait, what happened? Somebody took the cord to four. You, you really do look like a high school Jordy. kid. I was trying to beat Dylan. The line is behind Jordy. Oh, my bad. Hey, you can't look at the cheat notes, right? She'll tell you if you have problems. This is just practice. Dylan and Leah. Yeah. Well, they come back. How do you find out if our distance is wrong? Hmm? How do you find out She's going to tell you. I haven't figured out already. She had to go step all those off. Every without, single. Oh, it doesn't matter what um, pace length you are. Yeah, because it it's can multiply. But that's why you have your pace is yeah. different than his pace. Yeah. So when you multiply it out, it equals the same. See how smart you have to be to do orange hair. Smart kids love this kind of stuff. Yeah, it's, pretty it's challenging, it's you know, good. mentally. Yeah. And your math teachers will like you if you do this in PE. Are you both pacing it off and then averaging it? Because your degrees are pretty much spot on. Yeah. So make sure both people are doing it and see if there's a difference in y'all's faces. Faces, Our feet are on pace. Ooh, all our feet are on Lindsay. Is it the pace times? It's our, it's our feet per pace times. Times how many paces it took you to get there. You, if you're off by half a pace on getting there, it's going to throw you off. So you got to be so careful with it that. it has to be the exact number? Not the exact number, but if you're within, like if I took 21 paces and you took 21 and a half, that's still going to, that's why we're giving you that little bit of leeway. But if you took 23 steps, then it's going to be off. Oh, right? Guys, yeah, move over here. Move over here. I'm sorry, sorry, I'm sorry. I messed people. You're good. Get out of the way. Um, Lindsay, what does this say? 349? Yeah. 349? You guys' feet are way off. Check your multiplication. Are you doing your paces times feet per pace? What number are you using off your cord? So you should feet per pace this oh, times we're your by pace. 20. <laughs> I don't know where no, you got 20. Oh, you were doing it by the average. Don't do it by the average. Do it by feet per pace. Group Wait, are you using Hey. hey. Do you have our cords? <laughs> no. Oh, yeah, I do. Right. Huh? Oh, you weren't Just check your math on your calculation. Your degrees are pretty much right on, but your, your paces are off. Are both of you pacing it out? The same pace you took that, or are you walking faster? 
Because if you walk faster than them when you took your pace, it's going to throw your pace step off. We did the same thing. Okay. <laughs> it's just Let's practice. Nuh-uh. Yeah, if y'all want to we wouldn't need to behind either. Y'all trying to cheat. Y'all trying to cheat. Bring it back. There's a line. Uh, Laura has that confident look. Because so, we good. Looking. Don't shake your head, Jess. They all right. Well, I'm trying to. Some of them are close. Um. Oh. Don't breathe on my neck. I was talking to you, silly. So you don't breathe when you talk. Watch your math on your paces. It's probably you missing like a a step, one pace. So do if you both do your steps when you're doing it instead of just one of you. There's a line. You guys are behind math. It's right across the board, baby. Get that on camera. Technically, y'all are off by five degrees, but we're given a five degree difference. Yeah, see, that's so, right on oh, point, baby. You, you did miss one still. Oh, okay. It's just practice today. And your paces? Man, you wrote your paces points. down, didn't you? Yeah. No, you need, I need the feet, not the pace. Oh, I gotta do. Oh, you gotta do got the math. Step. Come see. You gotta math. Do the math. Hey, I want. I'm the first please. Six. Okay, here we go. I forgot. There we go. Why such a serious look? Why such a serious look? <laughs> Couple points you need to check, and make sure you're going from number to number. And like, if it's on that corner, you did it twice, you did them all twice, and we got the same thing twice in a row. You've got more. You, which one? All of them. We did them all twice. Well, because you've got that one right now, that one right now, that one right now, that one right now, and that one right, and that one right. It's just these numbers. It's not even within ten feet. <laughs> Are you two partners? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we These two. I forgot the first one wrong. And the last one. And the last one. Yeah, it's impossible. Which one's wrong? One? The degrees or the, the feet? The degrees and the feet. Are y'all going from the middle of the number to the middle of the number? Yes. And when you walk, you're going from the number and then counting one? Yeah. I mean, how much off is it? Well, like your first one is about 30 degrees off, or 30 feet off. 30 feet? Yeah. If you're walking, if your pace is faster now than when it was when we did this card, that will throw it off. So right. your stride's different. Yeah, longer though. What? She said if your pace is off from when you start, because you you walking off. Fast. Like if you fall. If you walk faster day, now than when you did your pace, you it's going to completely throw it off because it changes your stride length. Think what about it. When count. you run, when you run, you have a longer stride yeah. than when you walk. So the faster you go, the longer your stride is. Right. I was trying to get away from Smith so I could count. The feet was a little bit loud. I was messing him Check up. It. Right. I can see where that would be a problem. <laughs> Still off on that one. That's all I was you didn't tell us that. Uh, there's an X right there. You just put it. There's two X's right there. <laughs> oh. Are you accusing your teacher of cheating? Oh, no. well, yes, no. he is. I didn't see the first yes, X, so I didn't. He's You're closer, you know, but it's still off. Well, it's a walk normal. I'm sorry. And it, it probably, honestly, normal, is exactly that. I'm, I'm gonna try. You closer well, on all of them, but it's still off. Who's different? Yeah. Okay. We normally know we have one room, but we want to make sure the other ones are. <laughs> right. So, Michael, are you are you kind of getting it now? Because um, you were absent last class. Yeah, I, I understand the compass and everything. Um, hey, we just take the pieces. Yeah. See, Deidre was a little lost sheep last class because she had missed, Take and now she's... Both of y'all do your paces to see if the accuracy, because your paces Darn are it. off. Okay, we got to Make sure you walk in the do. same speed as when you did your paces. Because that will throw it off, and I think that's what most people are having the problem with. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go visit Claire now. See what she's doing down here. Are you playing security? General student management. And if she's got the but she's got the answer sheet, so they're going to her for the answers. That's good. Any major problems? 
Uh, no, I mean, just a little. little things like not wanting to do the exercises and stuff but you just got to pay attention and make them do it yeah you think that would be in high school oh yeah and then you can just see them get a little discouraged like if they don't get it right but you just... and why do you think this group gets so discouraged so because they're good at everything that's right yeah. so if you're teaching this in a, a elective PE mm -hmm. you're gonna have a lot of people if they don't get it right first they just want to quit mm -hmm. and you can't let them quit I think the, the bonus points is a good incentive to keep going. Oh, I do too, especially at the end of the semester. Oh, yeah. You have to kind of bribe because they're all sick of school. Oh, yeah. Um, you know, they, um, when, after, when, the, when it gets around prom time, uh, the, you know, everybody's just oh, yeah. ready to get out of school. Sir, yes, sir. I have a question. Okay. We've been trying to get the degrees right for this one. The first time was wrong, it was 165. It was wrong. This time was 160, was still wrong. We tried, like we measured, we, we lined it directly, one to three, it's 165 or 160. It's, it's there, like, it shouldn't Every be. Time? One yeah, to three? Yes, it shouldn't Did be. Did she wrong. tell you how much you were off by when she checked it or no? No. Okay, I'm gonna go check for you, just wait right here. Right. My leg is killing me. Nobody told you to go play basketball. Oh, it was in my class. Oh, well, oh, that's true. You got <laughs> and I was fine. Like, I already played one match. Keep working on that lesson plan. Oh, Monday yeah. is kind of come before you know it. Okay, you're in the ballpark area. It's not far off. From this. Yeah, but like we 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 like we put even line it like with the line and the small thingy. Yeah. Like we put it the right. Small thingy. Is, <laughs> oh the, yeah, you're ready the, to teach this. I can. This is this is what I want you to do for me. Do it for me one more time, and see if, if you get any closer. If not, we're I mean we're not going to be that hard on y'all. Okay. Right. We just need you to get in the ballpark range, but you're close. You're you really not that far off. You have to walk at the same speed you did your pace. Well, yeah. he's doing the pace. I kind of walk the same speed. I'm yeah. like. Yeah. Yes. Just, just try it one more time for me and see what y'all get and come show me. So what, how, how bad is he off? Um, with the degrees, he's 10. So, I mean, it's getting closer. It's so, supposed to be 170. Do you have any theory as to why he's, they're not doing it? Well? I, mean, I mean, it's probably pace, especially because when, and, and it could be, you know, if someone's standing in front of the sign and they're not getting it directly on it because that's what we did it for. Right. From paper to paper. So it could be a bunch of factors, but I mean, you obviously can't penalize them for all of that. So, but if they can't get it pretty close in the gym when they go outside, it's going to really, uh, really be yeah. off. That's why I, I want them to try again. And we'll go from there. I'm doing good, guys. Keep it up. We get up. If you can't get within five degrees in here, when we go outside, you'll be, be lost. way off. So if, if you can figure out what you're doing wrong today, mm -hmm. it'll be fine Friday. Okay. And we'll have the amazing race. <laughs> 30 points. Oh 30 extra points. Oh, I'm just, I, I woke up at 7 to finish up that lesson plan. And he's still uh, thinking, uh, wait, me, he's thinking DBB, huh? Yeah. Oh, all right. And then you can do it again. See, he's, they put their cones down here with their little activities at each station. They've got their mats for the, if somebody wants to do sit-ups on the mats. But if they're going back to recheck, they don't have to do the activity. They need a little dispute settled, huh? 255. So I want you to stand right there and go to 8 and publish. I have to do it? Yeah. How about y'all try it again? Check your Wait, we done it 10 times. Same answer. Okay. Yeah. Go right to the cone. I mean, like, you want to make sure you get to the cone? To the cone? No, the one with the paper. Are you going to 4? No, 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 8. 8. Right, yeah. You got to get it right on the paper again, not the cone. 
Better than the paper. Paper, paper. You just have to get within five degrees of what it's supposed to be. Yeah, and I keep getting the same exact number. Or really close. Eight or four, Which, you see what you're getting? Four? Eight or four. Four. Look, stand up, Michael. You, if you sit down, you, you may you very well to? throw things off. Okay, 245 and 44. I'm going to go check. I need to go fix this real quick. I got 29. Look, when they did it, yeah. when she did it, she's standing up. So, yeah, all right. I thought it so was, was flat. Against right against, against, put your back against the paper. Ah. Right, you know, you, if you're a little bit off. It, there you go. People race for miles and miles yeah. around the woods and the brook area. Put it down you know, somewhere. It ain't going to be 265. Yeah, 265. And they time you. You have to go and you pick up like little sheets and you hit a, the beeper. And uh, Hey, excuse me, boys, we're in the line of fire. <laughs> so there are big orienteering clubs in almost all the rural states. Texas has got a big. A big group that does it. Probably California. In, um, Arkansas, Kentucky, Tennessee, check this northern puppy out. Louisiana, where they have all those. Let me check forest. this puppy yeah. out. I can't. Get, get over the over the magnifying glass. Wait, look. Yeah, don't. No, over. no, no it's like, I look. Can't see no, it. not the magnifying. <laughs> the little line. Look through the little line. There's a little groove that you look through. If you look at the magnifying glass, it's going to screw everything up. Are you looking through the groove? 245 for the tensile. Okay, move in. I'm so happy. Just put up. Look through this. Give me a finger. I'll run out. And just skip skipping. And number four. Alright. Now put it down so we can see. Because you're too high. Excuse me, Mike. Oh, I'm not in your way? Uh -uh. Okay. <laughs> right on the sheet of paper, right? Huh? Uh, make sure you aim right at that sheet of paper. Right at the number. Oh, I didn't put my name on it. Yeah, I kind of need your name on it. Could you pick up uh, the cone at seven for me and the two rugs, please? Just the cone and the rugs. Via, are you finished? Could you go pick up, pick up the cone at five and the rugs? Thank you, I appreciate it. Reflection. Reflection. Yes, reflection. Uh, student management. Oh, you got it.